Ah, come on! Power jeans! Power jeans! Power jeans! Power jeans! Power jeans! First workout since just before Christmas, which I'm not too happy about this being four days after Christmas, three days after Christmas. I also managed to uh, forget my shorts at home, so today we squat in jeans. Got some new Dragon Ball Z threads also for Christmas from my brother. Thank you, Jake. Uh, we've got a volume day today, and all I'm doing is squats and bench and deadlift. Um, things to watch out for that I'm looking out for today is uh, paying attention to my left knee, where I've been having my uh, issues in my IT bin and whatnot. Um, as I'm warming up here, paying extra attention to roll that out and stretch it out, because it's been compounding with an old problem that I have, which is that I have uh, loose, I guess you would say, um, ligaments in my knees. It's just a, it's a genetic thing. But uh, at one point in time, my left kneecap was tracking improperly because of it. Because um, I had overdeveloped the outside muscles of my quads right here, which is pulling this kneecap to the side. And uh, the IT band is not helping with that at all in this situation. But So this whole area I have to pay attention to because it's very tight in here. And it tends to pull the kneecap to the side right now. So if I'm not really focusing on consciously engaging my inside quad muscle in my left leg, it can get a little uncomfortable. So we're going slowly up. Um, goal is 250 pounds for five sets of five on the squats today, 190 for five sets of five on the bench, and then uh, I think I'm just gonna put like 320 pounds in the bar and do as many deadlifts as I can before I'm done with deadlifts, and that's going to be the whole workout today. Getting ready for, I'm, gonna, I'm doing this, and I'm going to take the next like two or three days off to recover, and then do uh, one rep max tests to ring in the new year. Probably going to record that on the second, because I fully intend to be half conscious for most of the first. <laughs> so... That's the goal for today, but I also haven't put anything up on the YouTube channel since the beginning of December. I apologize for that. There's a, a number of reasons, none of which are really sufficient excuses, outside of the fact that I just got a little burned out towards the end of the year and uh, had some other stuff going on and was working on some other things like the uh, RPG Fitness Expansion ebook, The Iron Legion, which is out right now, at least in pre-order form. You can get the rough draft of the book and then when the cover and formatting and instructional videos are all done, which I uploaded most of the videos yesterday for the exercises that are in it, um, you will be able to get the full book as well. But if you pre-order right now, you get it for $2 off and get the full version sent to you as soon as it is done. Um, but yeah, so anyway, I apologize for not being around on YouTube all that much. And even uh, posts on the blog have been a little spotty. Uh, had an unexpected hospital trip. Um, nothing major, everything's okay. It was not me even. Um, but uh, just all kinds of stuff going on. Um, but getting geared up for the new year and uh, feeling pretty good about it. Uh, got ideas for a lot of new things coming to y'all. Um, my resolutions, not that I like resolutions, but my goals for the new year are uh, one of the things I want to do is work my way back up to uh, at least five videos a week here on the Be A Game Character channel um, and also daily videos over on the Best Dan Wallace again. Um, so we'll see, but for now, we'll keep working out. <sighs> see, I feel fine here. So when I go back up, that's where the tightness comes in. It's not pain so much as just more tension than usual. The eccentric motion also a little bit. Oddly enough, if I feel any pain, it's actually on the eccentric. The down, not the concentric, which is the up. Um, doing okay so far. We're going to keep going. 
Still playing it safe on it, but, uh, you know, there comes a point where you get familiar with injuries, especially persistent ones, and, you know, I don't advise this mindset if you haven't seen a doctor yet, but I've had a number of injuries in my life. Uh, where the doctor's just like, yeah, you got this thing, you're kind of going to live with it, and uh, here are some things you can do to alleviate it. One of those things is the fact that my ligaments are not very tight, and my IT bands like to be tight, and it's just how life is for me. So, you know... You hit a point where you're like, I'm just familiar enough with this injury that I know exactly how much to push and then stop pushing. And the majority of people who are into either sports or fitness or martial arts or anything along those lines will be familiar with that concept. <laughs> so, yes, there is uh, definitely a you know, good point about don't work out if it doesn't feel good, and that's always what I stress, but also understand what not feel goods are okay to work through and what not feel goods are not okay to work through. <laughs>
Oh. Still good. Second last set. Oh. I haven't done 250 for 5x5 yet. Feeling pretty good so far, so I feel good if I make it. Oh. <laughs> now I jinxed myself. <laughs> Intentionally, but all right, that was pretty good. One more. Last set. Here we go. <sighs> Didn't set right. Coming off a full week's rest, I would hope so. Almost a full week's rest, but still! That was really nice. Five by five at 250. It's a nice round number. One of the things that I regret about this year is that uh, I never really got close to my. Uh, Sub 25 minute 5K. Uh, mostly because of the issue with my T band. Because running more than anything irritated it. So I haven't really been able to run for like the past three months. I still haven't run since I, you know, started taking time off for it. Um, not planning on running much until it feels, you know. Basically 100% again, which doesn't yet. It's still tight, which means that, you know, if I screw up on a run, I could very well put myself out of commission for another month. Um, but that one really bones me out just because I was starting to make real progress, and I've never been much of a runner. So, you know, felt good, man. <laughs> you know, I've always been, you know, strength and martial arts oriented, and uh, other than, you know, climbing, gymnastics, stuff like that. But, uh, but running was never my forte, and I was finally starting to enjoy it and improve in it and stuff like that, and I went and injured my damn self. So uh, that's something I would like to pick up again in 2018, but again, I'm going to wait until this thing feels A-OK -okay again before I attempt that. So, moving on to bench now. Uh, like I said, target is 190 for 5x5. Five five. Although typically, on volume days for my legs, when I'm doing my 5x5 five five squats, I won't hit all five reps on the bench, just because I'm doing it second and I'm kind of fried. Part of the uh, cool thing <laughs> about when I had to stop doing leg stuff is that uh, starting in on benching, I was basically doing all upper body workouts all the time, so I added like easily 20 or 30 pounds to my bench over the course of like September through December, so, you know. <laughs> but yeah, we'll see what I get today. Oh, this is just warm up reps.
And I just noticed that I'm tight on time, so we're going with minimal rest for these as well. Oh boy! Set number two. Okay. Come on! Power jeans! Power jeans! Power jeans! Power jeans! Alright, number three, here we go. Tom Sawyer mode! No, Tom Sawyer mode would be if I got somebody else to lift the weight for me while I ate an apple and watched them. Ooh, can't pinch my back. Yeah. Yeah, got it. Okay. All right, here we go. One. Now. That was real weevil wobbly. That was real weevil wobbly. I didn't like that at all. So unfortunately, in the interest of time, this is actually my last set. I have to get home. Uh, wife has an appointment she has to get to, so. And the kid's napping, so I gotta go home and be with him so she can go do her thing. So this is the last set. I'm gonna get five. I don't care. I don't care if Power Jeans can see me through. I got this. Come on, Power Jeans. Power jeans, power jeans, power jeans, power jeans. One. Two. Three. Four. Four. Power jeans. All right, cool. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Just kidding. So, uh, for those longer time fans of the YouTube channel, you will definitely recognize my humble basement beginnings. Uh, I realized that in addition to still needing to do my deadlift for the day, and yes, I missed my last set of bench press, but we won't think about that. In addition to still needing to do my deadlifts today, I have to give Old Reliable a send-off here. My, uh, standard bar and plates as well as the rack that you've seen in older Be A Game Character videos and the uh, the plate tree, the weight tree stand, whatever you want to call that thing. And, and most of my other old fitness stuff is uh, going on to a better place um, with the... Uh, with the advent of Hero Academy Fitness and my newer rack and weight set there and the fact that I do almost all my training there now, uh, this stuff's been just kind of sitting in the basement collecting dust, so I decided to do what I was originally done, uh, which was uh, pass it on to someone who needs it more than I do. So I hopped on Facebook Marketplace and put it up for a bargain of a price because I was more interested in seeing you go to a good home and getting, you know, back a little bit of money for it rather than... Uh, you know, making a lot of money off of it, which is exactly how it worked out with me. I got this set from uh, a friend, Greg, who is a triathlete, friend of the family, actually grew up with my dad. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so this is going to be the last time you see Old Reliable, and uh, we're going to give him a proper send-off. I've got, uh, what did I say, 325 by 325? I've got... 250 plus another 60 is 310 plus 15 is 325. I can do math. Good. So I've got 325 on the bar, and we're just going to pick it up and put it down as many times as we can before, you know, I'm absolutely spent. I'm going to shoot for. You know, I'm not even going to say a number. I'm just going to do it as many times as we can. Not going to guess. Oh, here we go. Oh, I cooled down. One, two, three, four. Ooh. Never mind, we're not.
not doing ham wraps. This is actually what bothers me. Huh. Yeah. Wow. Huh. How about that? Squats didn't. Deadlifts did. Well, that was four. Love you, old reliable, but uh, that's the most of set up we're going to get. I'm not going to chance taking the knee any further than it's gone, so. Oh, well. <sighs> it's weird, man. Power jeans, you failed me. Goku, I'm sorry I dishonored you. That's right. We got four in, and uh, old reliable's going to a better home tomorrow. Well, that's really it now. Thank you for watching. As always, remember to live boldly, change the world, continue to be awesome. Bye-bye.